welcome dear students in today's lecture we will discuss the maclaurin series expansion to find the maclaurin series expansion of the function f of x first we see the statement of maclaurin theorem the statement of the maclaurin theorem is any function of x that is f of x can be expressed in ascending that is increasing power of x where f of x and its successive derivatives are finite so the by theorem of this statement maclaurin's theorem f of x is equal to f of 0 plus x into f dash of 0 plus x square divided by 2 factorial into f double dash of 0 plus x cube divided by 3 factorial into f triple dash of 0 plus so remark maclaurin series is a particular case of taylor series that is in the Mac taylor series expansion if we put in taylor series expansion of in terms of x minus a if we put the value of a as a zero so we get a maclaurin series expansion that is in taylor series expansion which is about the point x is equal to a if we find the taylor series about the point x is equal to zero which is nothing but the maclaurin series known as a maclaurin series so that the maclaurin series is a particular case of taylor series expansion so here some standard expansions are given which are to be find by using the maclaurin series expansion so the first and second which is expon for the exponential function so first one is the expansion of e raised to x in ascending power of x is 1 plus x plus x square divided by 2 factorial plus x cube divided by 3 factorial plus x raised to 4 divided by 4 factorial plus so on. similarly if we have to find the expansion in power of x of e raised to minus x so we use the expansion of e raised to x we just replace the value of x as a minus x so we get the expansion in the ascending power of x for e raised to minus x and the expansion is 1 minus x plus x squared divided by 2 factorial minus x cube divided by 3 factorial plus x raised to 4 divided by 4 factorial minus so on. so the difference between the expansion of e raised to x and e raised to minus x both the series expansion is in ascending power of x only the sign difference in sign the alternating sign for the expansion e raised to minus x now from 3 to 5 these are the expansion for the trigonometric function sin cos and tan so the expansion of the sin x which is x minus x cube upon 3 factorial plus x raised to 5 upon 5 factorial minus x raised to 7 upon 7 factorial and so on similarly the expansion of the cos x is equal to 1 minus x square upon 2 factorial plus x raised to 4 upon 4 factorial minus x raised to 6 upon 6 factorial and the expansion of the tan x is x plus x cube by 3 plus 2 x raised to 5 upon 15 plus 17 x raised to 7 by 3 1 5 plus so on now from 6 to 8 the series expansion 
is for the hyperbolic function sin hyperbolic x cos hyperbolic x and tan hyperbolic x and the expansion is sin for the sin hyperbolic x x plus x cube upon 3 factorial plus x raised to 5 upon 5 factorial plus x raised to 7 upon 7 factorial plus so on now the for expansion is for the cos hyperbolic x is 1 plus x square upon 2 factorial plus x raised to 4 upon 4 factorial plus x raised to 6 upon 6 factorial plus so on the expansion is for the tan hyperbolic x is x minus x cube by 3 plus 2 x raised to 5 upon 15 minus 17 x raised to 7 by 3 1 5 plus so on now 9 and 10 expansion is for the logarithmic function log 1 plus x and log 1 minus x log 1 the expansion for the log 1 plus x is x minus x square by 2 plus x cube by 3 minus x raised to 4 by 4 plus so on and the expansion for log 1 minus x is minus x minus x square by 2 minus x cube by 3 minus x raised to 4 by 4 and so on and the expansion 11 and 12 which is one for 1 upon 1 plus x and 12 is for the 1 upon 1 minus x the expansion is for 1 1 upon 1 plus x is 1 minus x square minus x cube plus x raised to 4 and so on the expansion for 1 upon 1 minus x is 1 plus x plus x square plus x cube plus x raised to 4 plus so on the 13 number the expansion which is known as a binomial expansion 1 plus x raised to the power n and the expansion is 1 plus nx plus n into n minus 1 upon 2 factorial into x square plus n into n minus 1 plus n minus 2 divided by 3 factorial into x cube plus so on and the last one is for the tan inverse x is equal to x plus x cube upon 3 plus x raised to 5 upon 5 minus x raised to 7 upon 7 plus so on these all the expansion for the standard function expon uh, exponential trigonometric hyperbolic logarithmic and so on. And these are very useful to solve the example which are based on the Maclarian series expansion. So all of us we prepare this standard expansion to solve the example on the Maclarian series. So in next lecture we see some examples on the Maclarian series. So thank you.